what's going on guys? My name is Anthony. Today's video is a long one, everybody, so prepare yourself. But anyways, as you guys can read by the title, today I bring you 107 facts you might not know about Minecraft. Now, a lot of you have been requesting this video for ages, so here I am today to bring you exactly that. Now, if you guys do enjoy today's video, then be sure to give this video a like as it's gonna help me out a huge bunch. But anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into this ginormous video. I hope you all enjoy it. When Minecraft was first created, it was previously known as Cave Game. The person who purchased the one millionth copy of Minecraft actually received a special cape. It is not possible to destroy the nether star with any form of explosions. Minecraft is now over 7 years old. An egg has a 1 in 256 chance to spawn 4 chickens at once. The first development phase of Minecraft only lasted 6 days. Minecraft is currently the best selling PC game of all time selling over 24 million copies. Zombies can see players from up to 40 blocks away whereas other mobs can only see the player from up to 16 blocks away. In the PC version of Minecraft there are currently 300 170 splashes that can be shown on the main menu. If you look closely, the new boats that were added actually have moss growing underneath them. The Minecraft logo used to be different and it was made out of cobblestone. Standing inside of a cobweb will absorb some of the damage from TNT and creepers. When cows were first added into Minecraft, they didn't have horns on their head. You can make a creeper explode by using flint and steel. Critical hits can only be done when falling and not jumping. If you jump and hit the mob, you won't get a critical hit, but if you hit them while falling, you will get a critical hit. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, dirt slabs were planned to be added into the game. However, here we are six years later and we still don't have them. The dual wielding feature that was added in the 1.9 update was originally planned to be added in the 1.3 update. When end portals were first added, the texture for the end portal frame looked completely different to how they looked today. You have a higher chance of catching a fish when it's raining. Fence gates will actually be lowered if they are attached to cobblestone walls. You can avoid most of the damage from TNT by placing glass in front of you. You can change the colour of a tamed wolf's collar by using any dye. The original Steve skin had a beard. This was likely changed due to some players thinking it was a smile. You can tell if your tamed wolf's health is low or not, judging by how high or low its tail is. As you can see, when you give it food, its tail will rise. Zombies will drop their head if they are killed by charged creepers. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, the crafting table was originally called a workbench. The elytra item is actually a reference to the wing cap item Mario wears in the game Super Mario. Mario 64. Great game by the way. Rabbits used to be bigger in Minecraft 1.8 whereas in Minecraft today they are a lot smaller. The iron sword's texture was actually taken from Notch's unfinished game Legend of the Chambered. The apple's texture was also taken from Legend of the Chambered. Endermites will suffocate and die if they are on soul sand. When endermen were first added they originally had green eyes and emitted black smoke instead of having purple eyes and emitted emitting purple particles. Baby Zombie Pigman dropped the most XP out of any other mob in the game apart from boss mobs. The best way to avoid damage from skeletons is to dig a two block gap and stand inside of it and you will notice the skeleton arrows won't deal damage to you. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft you could only find three strongholds per world whereas in Minecraft today you could find 128 strongholds per world. The legs of a bed turn completely invisible when you go underneath it. Before biomes were added into Minecraft, worlds looked like this. As you can see, they look a lot different as the grass is a very bright green colour. The bottom part of cacti is actually a recoloured texture of wood. Chickens were originally bred using wheat, whereas in Minecraft today, they're bred with seeds. Zombies will not burn in daytime if they are inside of a cobweb. You are actually able to find your spawn with a compass with 
without actually crafting it. Just simply lay out the recipe in the crafting table and as you can see the compass will point towards spawn. Creepers will drop a music disc if they are killed by a skeleton. Dead bushes drop sticks. If you fall from a large height into an end portal then upon entering the end you will be greeted with death. Right clicking on a creeper in spectator mode will actually provide you with the creeper's vision which I think looks pretty cool. Endermen used to be able to burn in daylight. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, Notch, the creator of the game, planned to add exploding arrows but it sadly never made it into the final game. Placing carpets on top of fences are a great way of getting in and out of farms. This is useful because hostile mobs are not actually able to jump over the fence. You can actually make a staircase by using fences and carpets. It's impossible to hit an enderman with an arrow, egg or snowball. As of the Minecraft 1.10 update, endermen can now spawn in the nether. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, food was not stackable which was very annoying for players. If your nether portal breaks in the nether then don't worry, a ghast can actually reactivate it for you with their fireball. The crafting recipe for the enchanted golden apple has been removed as of the 1.9 combat update which means they can only be found in generated structures. This is how it used to be crafted. The green villager remained unused for a very long time in Minecraft but they've finally officially been added in Minecraft 1.11. If you fall from a height onto hay bale then it reduces the fall damage by 80%. Boats travel insanely fast on ice. Iron golems cannot take fall damage. When the killer bunny was first added into Minecraft it actually had a 1 in 2500 chance to naturally spawn. However you can only spawn them using commands now. There is a 1 in 10,000 chance that the Minecraft logo will say Mincecraft instead of Minecraft. Hostile mobs will not spawn in mushroom biomes, including the caves underneath the biome. When villagers were first added, they had a name tag above their head that read Testificate. The missing no splash is actually a reference to the infamous Pokemon glitch found in the first generation of Pokemon games, Missing No. As of the Minecraft 1.11 update, you can properly use name tags on villagers without opening the training interface. Spawning a bed in the nether will cause it to explode and potentially kill the player. If you save and quit the world right before you hit the ground then you will not take any full damage upon entering the world again. Before the beta 1.8 update, players could not sprint as it was not yet added meaning it was a lot harder to outrun mobs. Ocelots will attack and kill chickens. If you kill a zombie pigman in one hit then the rest of the pigmen won't aggro towards you. You can fill a large area completely with water if you place the water diagonally and do the following. Around Christmas time the chest texture will actually change to a Christmas present texture. In an unused area for the zombie pigman texture the words thanks Savobia can be seen. This was written by Notch to give credit and thanks to the original creator of the zombie pigment texture. Minecraft is actually harder around Halloween time as zombies, skeletons, wither skeletons and zombie pigment can spawn with pumpkins on their head which means they won't burn during daytime. The quiver item was an item that could be used to hold arrows and it was going to be added in the 1.9 update but it was sadly abandoned. You can make a rainbow sheet by using the name tag Jeb underscore. As of the Minecraft 1.9 update you can respawn spawned the ender dragon by using end crystals. In the first development phase of Minecraft you actually left clicked to place blocks and right clicked to destroy blocks which as most of you know is not how it is today. The poppy flowers you can find in your world actually replaced the rose flower which quite a few players were sad about, including myself. In the beta 1.9 version of Minecraft the appearance of the sun was changed from square to a more rounded look but this change was shortly reverted back to how it looks today. The first ever texture given to cobblestone was actually taken from Notch's unfinished game Ruby Dung. You can always get four blocks of wool from a sheep by doing the following. So if you punch a sheep seven times, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, then punch and shear the sheep at the same time and you will get four blocks of wool. You can breed two different sheep with colours that can be combined to form a 
new colour. During the snapshots of Minecraft 1.9, the boat's crafting recipe was altered to have an additional shovel as well as the five wood planks, but this change was later reverted. Sheep can still eat grass through half slabs. The higher your difficulty is, the more accurate a skeleton will be with their bow and arrow. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, using a potion of invisibility on a sheep was kind of useless. I'm sure you can see why. Skeletons have a 5% chance to spawn with a bow in their left hand. You are able to sleep during daytime if there is a thunderstorm. Placing a slime block right before you hit the ground can actually save your life. You can shear the pumpkin of a snow golem's head. In earlier versions of Minecraft, skeletons and zombies would not burn in daylight if they were standing on soul sand. Placing a bow on a slime block will cause the player to launch up into the air when they get inside the boat. You can change the mob that spawns from a spawner by using a spawn egg, which is very useful for map makers. You can control the speed of spectator mode by using the scroll wheel on your mouse. This is very useful for making cinematics. Standing on soul sand in the overworld will actually make the sky darker. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, cobblestone used to craft stone slabs. Your own tamed wolf will attack you if you hit yourself with an arrow. If a vindicator is given the name tag Johnny, then they will attack any nearby mobs. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, zombies used to drop feathers. If a villager is struck by lightning, it will actually turn into a witch. The wither boss will attack all living entities, including the ender dragon. Wild wolves will attack skeletons, sheep, and rabbits. The green liquid in the zombie pigment texture was originally going to be red to resemble blood. In Minecraft, Minecraft Alpha, creating a world had a 1 in 4 chance to spawn with a certain world type known as Winter Mode, where it would constantly be snowing. But anyways, that just about does it for 107 facts you didn't know about Minecraft. Be sure to let me know in the comments how many of the facts that you knew. But yeah, thank you so much for watching the video, everybody. I really hope you all enjoyed it. I worked very hard on this video, not gonna lie. It took a very long time to make. But yeah, I hope it was worth it. So thank you so much for watching, everybody. Have a fantastic day, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!